you're in a Power BI Pro or premium per user workspace and you want to use Copilot. If you notice, if I go into this report, which is in a pro workspace, it doesn't give us option for Copilot. Well, you still need an F64 to do it, but without moving the data set now, we can actually use Copilot. To do that, first, we have to go to the admin portal. Under tenant settings, we have to enable the Copilot feature where it says Copilot can be designated to fabric Copilot capacities. That's the key over here. Once we have done that, that essentially will take some time to implement. And then if we go over here under capacity settings, here if you notice I have a capacity called FCC and in the Copilot capacity, I'm gonna, this is a new option that pops up for the admins under capacity. Uh, you can assign this for the entire organization or open this up to say specific people. And then we're gonna say apply. Now, technically this is enabled. And then when we head to our Power BI report again, let's see how long it takes to open. And guess what? That's pretty fast. Copilot popped up. Give me an executive summary. So there we have it. It has given me a summary and if I wanted to see, for example, what is the top two sales territory by sales? There you have it. Now you can leverage Copilot in pro and premium per user workspace and also capacities that are less than F64 if you have a direct lake mode and whatnot. This allows, extends the Copilot capability where you can designate it. And obviously, as you can tell, it's F64, it's $8,400 a month, but here's the catch. It's also $11 an hour and about 40 cents a minute, meaning we can always figure out a way to hack through this and stay tuned for a session. We'll probably get it out sometime in late February, early March, how we show you how you can use that without paying the full price of uh, running F64 all the time. All right, have fun.